So welcome to TechSoup's Public Good App House demo event, apps for community-based fundraising. Next, we have Chris Blavelt. Chris is a passionate Muslim American entrepreneur committed to building up the global Muslim community to reach its full potential. Chris is the CEO and founder of LaunchGood.com, the world's largest faith-inspired crowdfunding platform, which has raised over $350 million across 152 countries from over a million users. Thanks for joining us today, Chris. Hey, thanks, everybody. I'm so happy to be here. All right. So uh, really quick, I'll introduce LaunchGood and just talk about what we do. So uh, it's nice to hear HipGive. We're kind of like HipGive, but for the Muslim community. Uh, I'm one of three founders. Um, I have a crazy background, so engineer, film producer, um, multiple startups. Uh, There's also a brilliant young woman, uh, Amani, that I work with, and a brilliant designer, Omar. Um, and, you know, what's cool about us, and I, I think this is true for a lot of people here, like, we didn't, you know, do this because we're MBAs and saw business opportunities. Like, we're just community activists, and we really believe in the cause, and we just kind of started this thing in our backyards and bootstrapped it and, you know, grew it to about 100 people and $350 million raised uh, for charities around the world. Um, and so if you don't know LaunchGood, you can basically think of it as like the Muslim GoFundMe. It's the, the world's largest crowdfunding platform. Um, I, and I believe it might be the largest faith-based crowdfunding platform for, for anybody. Um, and uh, we do a lot of cool things to help charities with fundraising and Giving Tuesday is definitely a big part of it. Um, so we're a donation-based platform, kind of like you know, everyone else uh, or hip give that was going before us. Um, I already mentioned we've crossed $350 million, um, over a million unique donors, almost 50,000 campaigns. I think what, what kind of makes us, is this is pretty standard. I'm not going to go over this because I, th- I think people here now, you know, if you didn't know before with hip give and the others, you know what crowdfunding is. Um, there's some cool things that we do that I think, and you could do on LaunchGood, but uh, I think you can do it on a lot of different websites. Um, one is leveraging trackable links. Um, it's been a game changer for a lot of our fundraisers. And last year we had like three charities on Giving Tuesday that each raised over $100,000. I think one of them like $300,000. And the common denominator is all three leveraged trackable links. Um, and I can talk about that a little more maybe um, in the Q&A. Um, extension of your team. Uh, you can add teammates, and this this even goes with the trackable links. It's really important that you don't do this alone, that you engage your community and you empower them. You know, make sure that your campaign is really visually appealing and connects with people's hearts. Yeah, this is what I was talking about with the trackable links. So we set up this insights tab. You can you can probably do this in a lot of different ways. Um, I'm sure there's ways you could do it with you know Google Insights. Uh, this is just how it looks internally to us. Uh, there's probably even Bitly and some other things that you can use to do it. But within LaunchGood, we have the ability that, and you know, you can create any link. Um, if you see here, for example, there's two users, uh, one named Imran and one named Ali, that referred four donors between them that drove in $127 you know, in donations, for example. We started this because there was a charity on Giving Tuesday like three years ago called Celebrate Mercy. And they had this idea of, and they're fantastic fundraisers. They're like, we want to really incentivize our donors and we're going to offer a free vacation for one, you know, one donor and their family if they're able to drive 10 or more donations to our Giving Tuesday campaign. And that like every set of 10 becomes like an extra raffle ticket. So they needed some tool to be able to see you know, how many donations each of their donors drove. Um, and so we built this tool for them, actually. And uh, they got, I don't know, maybe 100 volunteers. And between those 100 volunteers, um, the av- you know, they each on average drove like 15 donors. Um, so it was 1,500 donors in one day between all these volunteers. And uh, that was a total of, I think, about $150,000 in donations. So it cost them a, a vacation. You know, they had to pay like, I don't know, $5,000 or something as a giveaway to one of their volunteers. Uh, but for that, they got, you know, all this work was done on their behalf and it raised $150,000. So that was really, really effective fundraising strategy for Giving Tuesday. And now we're seeing, you know, every year the top charities uh, implement this strategy. There's some other things that we do unique to us, but it's all about gamification. So Launch Good, we offer a leaderboard. So um, on Giving Tuesday, we give out like, I don't know, it's like $100,000 in prizes. So, you know, whoever raises the most money or gets the most donors gets like $25,000. And um, it's very effective to motivating donors, actually. 
So, so this is something you, you don't have to be part of LaunchKit to take advantage of the psychology of this. Um, and you know what I, I see it all the time, actually, if you can find a big donor, it could be an individual, it could be a foundation, it could be a, a corporation that's willing to say like, hey, you know, if you can raise $50,000, I will match 50,000. Or for every dollar you raise, I will double it up to, you know, $10,000, something like that. Donors get so motivated. Um, they really like just open up, you know, and, and I've seen people like maybe their average donation is usually 10, $20. All of a sudden they give like $200. And I asked them like, why did you give so much? They're like, well, it was being doubled. So I felt like I couldn't, you know, I couldn't avoid, uh, I couldn't miss the opportunity. I think a lot of people here are probably familiar with Facebook's giveaway I, this year, maybe 10 million. I, I can't remember if, what they announced, but I think it might be $10 million giveaway. The reality is that stuff's gone in a second. Like, you know, $10 million, like you're lucky if you get $100 of it. It's still useful just to be able to tell your donors like, hey, Facebook's giving away $10 million and all we got to do is get, you know, donors and they'll match it. We just got to do it right away. Um, and your donors will be really motivated. So a lot of fundraising is psychology, having fun with it, showing your donors you're having fun with it and making them feel like they can be part of the fun. And this is related to team to team fundraising. So I, I think also Hipka mentioned this, but um, peer to peer fundraising functionality, this is something similar. Um, if you don't want to use trackable links or an alternative trackable links is you actually give everyone their own micro campaign. Um, so instead of using you know, links, it's like everyone creates a campaign. It's a little bit more work, but people tend to take it more seriously because if a campaign is in their name, it's not just like, oh, I'm helping celebrate Mercy fundraise, but now it's like Chris is fundraiser for Celebrate Mercy, I feel like my reputation is on the line. You know, I can't hide, like, I don't want it to say like zero dollars, you know, no, I'm going to work harder. So, you know, there's a lot of crowdfunding platforms that offer peer-to-peer -peer functionality. It's very effective. Cool. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs>